Latvia has been so much better than we thought it was going to be. We only stayed in Riga for one day. Which was not long enough. No. And then we scheduled one day for Jermala, which is where we are now. We've stayed in our apartment all day. So we stayed in our Airbnb all day today. Not because Jermala isn't cool. Check out like, this beach. Yeah, this beach is super awesome. We just really needed to catch up on some work. I edited two vlogs today. And I booked flights to and from Russia. Crazy, we're actually going to Russia. Yay! And now we're going to eat. Also, our flights from Russia to South Korea are in business class and they only cost us $15. Ooh, ooh. Thank you, British Airways. That was yesterday's Instagram story. We did not vlog yesterday. So days that we don't vlog for our YouTube channel, we try to at least share our day with you via Instagram stories. So if you're not following us on Instagram and you enjoyed that thing that you just saw, then there's gonna be a link down below. Make sure you follow us. We're almost at 10,000. So that would be very helpful in getting us to a nice round number. <laughs>
outlets to charge our stuff. But we did not know there was going to be free Wi-Fi and coffee. Highly recommend Lux Bus. Oh, so I think we actually rode on Lux Bus overnight, maybe from Poland a long time ago, but I completely forgotten that it existed. And there wasn't coffee on that bus. Yeah, that was awesome. So now all we have to do is find our way to our, our apartment. We've bought a public transportation card, and so we're just looking for the bus stop now. Should be there in about 30 minutes. I watched the movie. It was a really good one. <laughs> it was about a Soviet spy. And we're going to Russia in like a week. our Airbnb host. Hopefully she comes soon. It does look like we have a great location. We just walked right through the old city. We're like the very next street. And these houses look amazing. So we gave you a They like look kind of funny. What is that called? They're like dented almost. All oh, the walls are stone or really old wood. Oh my gosh. There's a coffee pot. All of the amenities that we need. A wash. This is so cute. Not only does this place come with a coffee pot, it came with a full bag of coffee. Oh yes, we've been drinking powdered coffee. It's so terrible. This smells so good. That's pretty good. Really? It sounded very good. Thanks. Oh, I'm so happy. We are linking this Airbnb in the description. Bow show. And two really romantic twin beds that we're probably going to smush together into one big bed. I love this place. Yeah, about the food. We just got settled into our Airbnb. Our host was a man of very few words. He was like, here's the keys. Enjoy. And then that was it. He just left. I don't think that was the actual host. I think that was like her friend. Well, whoever let us into the apartment. <laughs> he just left. Yeah. Now that we're in a new city, first things first, we're going to find some food. <laughs> So we are sitting down for dinner. Everything just happened really quickly. We read about this place on the internet. It is a medieval themed restaurant. You walk in, she said that she doesn't have menu just because she knows what she has. Pies, soup, drinks, pickles. What else was there? She said, no need to waste paper. <laughs> so we told her we would take the soup and then she dipped this huge ladle into this barrel on the ground gave us this huge bowl of elk soup. And you don't get a spoon, you have to drink it. And then these are the pies. I got mushrooms. And there's a huge jug of pickles and you can fetch your own pickles, as many as you want, but you have to stab them with a big spear. Yeah. Pickles. 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 Pickles.
That is delicious. And it was only about $3. Successful dinner. That place had two major red flags. It just screamed tourist trap. One, it was themed. And two, it was located like on the main square. I would have never gone in there had we not read about it on the internet, but I'm so glad that we did. We're gonna have to come back too, because there was this huge hunk of meat that people were eating, and you get a knife and a stick, and you just like eat it with the stick. They don't give you any utensils. And like, I feel like normally somewhere like that, being in the square and being like themed for tourists would be really They're expensive. Never very good. Either. But we paid eight euro for the entire meal and ate as many pickles as we wanted. Which was three because they're huge. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we are calling it a day and we will be exploring Tallinn. Or is it Tallinn? Tallinn? I don't know. We'll be There's exploring the city that we're in that starts with a T tomorrow.